New at noon, the woman who was targeted in a Worcester stabbing rest at a restaurant has died. Her identity has not been released. Police say a New Hampshire man targeted her. WBZ's Michelle Fisher has more now from Worcester. This afternoon, we're learning new details about that deadly stabbing that happened here at O'Connor's. Police saying that a man from Derry, New Hampshire, walked into the restaurant, located the victim, who he used to date, and attacked her. Affirmative O'Connor's. I guess there's a suspect from a stabbing possibly pinned down in the parking lot. When Worcester police arrived to O'Connor's Bar and Grill just before 8 last night, officers say they found several good Samaritans holding down 28-year-old Carlos Asensio. One of the men, Alan Corson Jr., was at the restaurant eating with his family when the woman was attacked. My son jumped up immediately when he heard the woman screaming, and he ran towards the screaming. Kirsten's father says his son tackled the suspect and with the help of several others held him until police came. In the process, he too was injured. My son actually, he, he didn't even realize he got a knife wound to his back, so he got cut from the gentleman with the knives. Kirsten had to get stitches. The 31-year-old victim suffered serious injuries and was taken to the hospital where she was pronounced dead. Okay. Makes you think. <laughs> No matter where you are, something like this can happen. The suspect in this stabbing now facing a number of charges, including murder and assault and battery with a dangerous weapon. No word just yet on when he'll be arraigned on those charges. Reporting in Worcester, I'm Michelle Fisher, WBZ News.